Welcome back, everyone. This is Sports Cards 24-7. I got a shiny chrome day. We're going to rip a little bit of this and a little bit of that. I got one pack of 2020 chrome there. The update and stadium club. My buddy Jason's going to go ahead and open this last. And I'm going to go ahead and bust into this first. I want to say thank you to everyone still supporting the channel. We're at 460 subs. If you have not subscribed, please do. I'm really excited to feature a new giveaway coming up. I will be posting the information Monday. But this fat pack back here. Yep, Dunruss. We're going to go ahead and give that away. I'm going to throw in a couple other packs for a couple other prizes. But please stay uh, tuned in because we will be doing that at the beginning of the week. But for me and Jason, we're going to open some shiny chrome. My favorite every year. I love chrome. Bowman chrome, Topps chrome. You could put anything in chrome and I'd probably buy it. <laughs> Point in uh, being Stadium Club chrome. Exactly. Uh, tops caught wise to that. I hate to say it, but they know exactly what they're doing. I'll go uh, open this first We'll go to the 2020 chrome after that pack and then we'll finish with the stadium club chrome. I always Want to open these on the bottom, but I always do it on the top for some weird reason uh, 21 Blaster boxes they caught wise and uh, they open on the side like panini oh, nice. hanger boxes So you don't have to rip into this like a Madman Wow, look at this thing. I need a chisel and a hammer just to get into this thing. Look at that. I'm afraid I'm going to damage the cards if I pull any harder, but... Now you get the three, or no, two exclusive Pink Wave uh, parallel cards out of these hanger boxes, which the hanger boxes for Chrome were new altogether this year. Two exclusive. Remember, in years past, they didn't have hanger boxes at Topps Chrome. So... I think, uh, I hate to be bitter, but if we're not careful, folks, this might be the beginning of another Junk Wax era. So I always try to get the number parallels and, uh, you know, be, care be careful of overproduced products. It's still fun to open products, I can't lie, but still. If we're not careful and we keep demanding it, they'll keep making it. Devi Grulon. Rookie card. Oh, that's cool. Number 44, Hank Aaron. This is by the numbers and uh, numbers game insert that comes in the update set. Nice. This year's update, they had to get a little different because uh, they didn't have a season really and they didn't have any call ups. Here we go. Nestor Cortez, Seattle Mariners rookie pitcher. But they did good. They have a lot of short prints in the update series. They have a lot of cool looking cards. So I am a fan of any Chrome card they'll give me. Domingo Santana. Jesus Lazario. That is exactly the same as his rookie card, but it's a rookie debut. I actually have a gold autograph uh, of his I got out of a break this year. Nice. Which I think I recovered the information. I'll have that video sooner. Uh, King Griffey Jr., very cool card. And then Anthony Rizzo, World Series. Oh, no, excuse me, All-Star Game Guard. I love Rizzo. Great, great attitude, great player. He was a Red Sox, wasn't he? Yep, yeah, he was. Then he went to San Diego. And then he won a World Series with Chicago. All-Star Game, Cal Ripken Jr. The Iron Man. Ooh, Big Mike, I'll have to send you that, buddy. But, man, I'm sad about him. Bad, bad, bad injury. Yep. Too bad. Cameron Mabin, he's got some wheels. He's a fun player to watch. I've seen him play a couple times, actually. And the horse. The, yeah, the horse for sure. <laughs> that man right there, just open up the Hall of Fame and send him in. He might be a 100 percenter. I really think he's got... He could be. Yeah, he's got the ring now. Yeah, well, I think that was the last you know thing he needed. Something shiny in here, too. Jose! With the old school Astro. Bang on the trash can. Oh, wait. <laughs> Brock Holt. Great little utility player. Yeah, I, I miss him. Oh, that's a uh, refractor, too. Oh, nice. Oh, wait. Boom. Numbered. Numbered out of 250. That is definitely a refractor. I'm going to have to go through here a little more and look, but I didn't even know that was a uh, number parallel. Up. Won't put him in there for me. I will do that. Thank you. Very cool. And I've actually uh, been told by a couple people, it's not good to handle your cards on the side like this. You want to actually just lightly pinch them. That will create less edge wear 
than holding it that way. If you're light with it and careful with it, I don't think you're going to do much damage regardless, but I was told that, uh, especially on the older, thinner cards, it's a really good thing to do. Yeah, back to Brock Holt, we were down to spring training a few years back when he was still with the Red Sox, and my wife was going, Brock, Brock, will you sign my ball? Will you sign my ball? And he's like, well, I, I'll have to come over later. And, you know, most ball players will just blow people off. And sure enough, he came over and signed a ball really? afterwards. Yep. Nice. Yep. I actually heard a really good story about him, too, so it's good to know that it's true. Tino Martinez, 1977 home run derby. Oh, 97, excuse me. The glare was hard there. Nope. One of my all-time favorite players. My father and I collected everything we could find of his. Nice. And uh, it was a bittersweet time when I got his rookie card finally. But my dad knows I got it anyways. Okay. There we go. Acuna Jr. Young stud. He's amazing. He's one of my favorite players. Yep. All right, folks. Let's get Lucky here. Let's pull something amazing here. Come on, come on, come on. McCutcheon, pink wave, now a big time rookie coming up. Have your buzz. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> those are beautiful looking cards, though. Here. If I can find those hangers, I buy them. Yeah. I have not yet to open one. That's mine. I've opened one with a buddy, but right. never got one, so... And of course, I didn't get my favorite player, Rosa Reina, or somebody like that, but it is what it is. Now, and pull something sweet out of here, too. Why not? I got this pack out of a prime pack. I figured, why not? Let's throw it in there. McGee. There's another Hall of Famer right there. Yep. For sure. Good player. Javier Baez, again. <laughs> Oh, a die cut Ricky Henderson. This is a five card pack, folks. I knew it felt a little weird. Five card pack. Nice. Unnumbered, but very cool insert. Nolan Arenado and Carlos Correa. Talks about him uh, getting a extension. Well, he just turned down the offer that he was given for 120 mil. Yeah, he, it was definitely a low ball yeah, offer. I don't know. A little spank. <laughs> now, Jason here is going to get lucky. And pull something nice. I'm gonna There's try. a knife for you. We are going to try. <clears throat> this pack uh, was Stadium Club Chrome. It comes with the x Fractor pack, I believe. Right. So. Here, hear me that blade. I get nervous around it. No, I hear you. I work with somebody that never shuts their knife and leaves them lying around everywhere. And <sighs> that's dangerous. Don't forget, I, I work with knives every day. Oh, yeah. No, I... For you kids out there, don't play with knives. <laughs> Use your teeth. No. <laughs> nice. Nice. All right. There's your X Factor pack. <clears throat> All right. Pull out of the way. All right. First time Jason's opened this. We opened it together a while back when we did the uh, chrome black, black chrome, black chrome. and a uh, blaster box of this. So this is the second time we've opened it. Hopefully we can get really lucky and pull some nice names. It's a beautiful looking set. Yep. Who's that, Hoskis? Yep, Reese Hoskis. Hard to read these yeah, names. Yeah, darn right it is. I'm having a Hunter Harvey, right? Yep. yep. Well, it is hard to read these. Logan Webb. Who's that, Adrian? I can't even tell. Adrian Monario. Monario, um, yep. Cool. Alex, Alex Gordon. Gordon. He was a player that was supposed to be big, 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 and never panned hey, out. Hey, Will Clark. Clark. Will Clark. That's cool. Here, hand me the old one. I'll pull that out of your way. So keeping a tidy table here. <laughs> I'll try, anyways. How many cards are in those packs? Like six. Six cards. Yep. After opening the top chrome, it feels like a jumbo. <laughs> All right. Oh, I hear you. I hear you. All right. Willie Adams from the Rays. Chip Jones. Is that a... It looks like a parallel. Yeah, it almost. looks like something. Yeah, I'll let you check it out. Oh, I think that's the background. It's just a solid color, so... Yep. I have seen a... Bryson. Numbered uh, five auto come it's out of this. Kershaw again. Uh, Felix Hernandez. King Felix. Didn't he just start, try to get on the Oreo, Orioles? Well, I he think got he got released or something. Uh, really? He yep. was with Atlanta last year, but he never played. So. Buxton. 
Byron Buxton. He was going to be the greatest thing. He's still a good, solid player. Yeah, but yeah, he's not. I'm glad I sold out of his cards when I did because they never amounted to what I thought they were. What do we got here? An old Sandy Koufax Ooh, card. black and white. Nice. Let's see if that's a numbered parallel. We'll flip uh, around. Nope. nope. Nope, not numbered, but nice looking card. For sure. Carlos. Here we go. Is this numbered? Uh, Carlos Carrasco. I don't care about that. I'm looking at the oh, card behind Oh, it. the trout. Yeah. Now we'll get a wait, wait on that. Oh, come on. <laughs> Jonathan Hernandez. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan Reynolds. Oh, we gotta wait on that. Dylan's ooh, Oh Otto. <laughs> Otto. Dylan Otto. C's rookie auto. Boom. Oh, there you go. I bet well let's see another auto with the trout. I wish yeah, that would transfer. Mike Trout. Nice. Beam team. Those were all of the rage when I was younger. Can you imagine if we hit that for an auto though for you? I would have run <laughs> out the door. <laughs> Theo, see you bye. Yeah. Well hey. <laughs> Nice. I'll say Carly on you. I'm glad you... <laughs> I, I'd, uh, I'd forfeit. <laughs> a autograph, not bad, though. No, it's awesome. And then a beam team trout. I do wish... Well, wishing will get you nowhere in this hobby. Right. Hard work and a lot of trading will. All right. Last pack. Last pack mojo, plus the X-Fractor pack. JT. Good catcher right there. We got Ortiz. Nice. All healed up from being shot. Oh, it's Can sad day in baseball. Yeah. Jordy Mercer again. That's the uh, Brian Reynolds. Or excuse me. Corey Kluber. <coughs> Justin Turner. I think we got He's only one rookie Masher. out of that box. Nope. That's all right. You get the. I got an auto. I take an auto yeah. all day long. Dylan Cease auto too. He's gonna be a good pitcher. Quato. Now. This next pack is going to have something sweet in it. All right. Let's rub her down. Give me a autograph X-Fractor, a Rezzarina, Mike, Jordan. Just ask for Mike Trout. We know Mike you, Trout. You want, we know you want to. <laughs> well, why not? Hey, there's a guy that's pretty good. Yeah. He is pretty good. Is that Fernando? No, it's no, Guriel Jr. Guriel Excuse Guriel me. Jr. Still, he's yeah. a good player. like the hair. I, yeah, I dig it. If I could grow it, I would. Nice. Julio Tehran. Uh, Tehran, yeah. I can't see I it. Can, from... It's even worse on these cards. I can't even. I can't even tell. Sheldon Nice. And then Mike Trout. And then a Trout. Nice. Boy. That's hey, pretty cool in card. That's all right. Number one of the set, Mr. Oh, Trout. Yeah. Mr. Trout. I know someone that's building this set, the X Factor set. Oh, so nice. Maybe I'll. Uh, Reach out to him, see if I, I'm sure he's got what he needs already, but. Right. Well, awesome, man. Awesome. Not bad. Some we, decent pulls. Yeah. A numbered Brock Hill out of 250, a autograph, and that. Now, this is always a long question about this. <clears throat> With all these cards, even on secondary market, I paid roughly, I did buy that uh, blaster box a while ago for about $45, I think. Yep. And I think that's probably around what they're going for online. I got the hanger box for 25 and the pack, let's just call that like five bucks. So I got an autograph of Beam Team for about half of what the hobby box is going for this. Right. And the top's chrome, forget about it. That's going for a lot more money. So I always think retail, if you can get a little variety like this and you don't spend too much, is a great deal. If I could have bought in the one hobby box off tops of this for $89 when it came out, right. absolutely. But we all know what kind of luck we have getting something off the internet or even finding it in person. So, you know, do comparative shopping, watch fellow YouTubers, figure out what's a good deal, what you want to spend, and, you know, price per hit and return on investment. It wasn't a bad loss, and it was a lot of fun. So that's what we try to do, give you honest opinions of what we break and have some fun doing it. Thank you very much to Jason. He's got the hot hand with an auto here, and uh, we definitely have had some fun. Yeah, definitely. All right. Love open cards. Hey, this week... Another giveaway. I won't forget about these uh, awesome people have supported the channel. We're definitely going to be giving back. We're almost at 500. Keep showing love to Sports Cards 24-7. We'll love you back. And uh, tell your friends and family, please subscribe and like. And we'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.